Are you neglecting your children? Purposely, no. I, I don't care about the intent. Uh, right now, I'm interested in, in protecting the children. Now, there are signs of neglect. In your state, there are definitions of neglect. Correct. Now, and one is inappropriate dress, that you see kids not dressed properly. According to Connie, you, your children show up not dressed properly for the weather. She's concerned about that. So according to her, she says yes. Consistent hunger. There, I mean, I'm, I am curious why a seven-year-old is putting food in her backpack and bringing it home if she doesn't feel like she needs food there for herself and her little brother. And yeah, I have been program. told that you get food stamps. Is that true? Correct. And I have been told that you sometimes sell those food stamps for cash. I have before. And you'll sell like $500 worth of food stamps for $200 no. in cash? No. So what do you sell and no. for how much? If I need $50 for my car insurance or something, I have, yes. Where are you I'm getting the money lie. for the drugs you've been doing? The drugs I've been doing, I have been working. And I want to correct the, the child... DSS thing. Um, I went to court after the book bag incident. Mom had already turned me into DSS. They sent all the stuff to DSS. And my caseworker said that she wasn't listening to it, not to worry about it. It's even in my court papers. Nothing came okay, out. They of dismissed it. the case 48 hours after you took the backpack down there, a case that had been open for four years. Right. Okay. Poor hygiene. Uh, I mean, that's one of the definitions, poor hygiene. Correct. I mean, we've seen lice, we've had staph infections. I mean, that suggests poor hygiene, does it not? The lice also was in mother's house, too. Yes, <laughs> kids get lice. Kids get lice. Wonder they come how. home from I wonder school how. with I wonder lice. how it got there. Yeah, because it just... I mean, she was appeared. infested last week. Did you tell them that? Yes, I did. I told mm -hmm. the producer, producer that. Yeah. Consistent lack of supervision. I mean, there have been stories throughout you having children. Your two-year-old burning his hand on the stove. Nathaniel being caught hung on the fence when he was three years old. Stories that the seven-year-old is supervising the two-year-old while you're gone. Mm -hmm. That's not true, but okay. I mean, I'm, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm asking. No, that's not uh, that, true. That's what I'm being asking, told. No, no, no. That, no that's okay, not so true. you say that's not true. No. Uh, unattended physical and medical problems. I mean, certainly the lice and the staph infections are of concern to me, and it's my understanding that you've missed two appointments from surgery. Surgery for what? Camden. Ears. His ears. tubes, you were no My show for a surgery. You were no That's show for whatever. the first two surgeries. My son's You no whatever. showed. Whatever, Mom. Abandonment. Uh, certainly there's a question there. Mark says that you drop the kids off. You never know how long they're going to be. A day, mm -hmm. two days, a week, however long. Once. And two children. And I'm, I, I hope you've put these children through legal adoption process when you placed yes, them for I adoption have. and that you studied did home studies and, and you, you I complied still speak with the to law. The woman this day. Uh, to, Everything's so legal. you know where they are. Yes. And then underweight and poor growth at this point, uh, you know, we don't know. Uh, we know Nathaniel wasn't talking at three years old. The what? immediate family he would speak to, he didn't have enough confidence to speak to public. Oh my God. <laughs> do you have Where a prostitute babysitting your children? No, I do not. Oh, okay, really? I'm just telling you what she's saying. That's fine. I, I just want to know. That's we have a video it. of your apartment. I have to say, this does not look clean. Not it clean does not up. look oh, hygienic. Lord. No. Uh, this isn't just being messy. This seems to me to be uh, um, astoundingly neglectful uh, of the living environment. You have two children living in. You walk into those rooms, you see that every day, right? Correct. At what point do you not say, this is no environment for my children to be in. I need to clean this up. That is not just messy. That is unclean, correct? That is a buttload of clothes. Well, look at the bathtub. The bathtub's disgusting, yes. My drain won't drain. Yes, my apartment is ridiculous. I will not defend that. Well, why don't you do something about it? Well, I guess I need to. Do you want to have more children? I would like to get married one day and have another child, yes. Do you have a story or a question for me? Click the link in the description and tell me what in the world is going on.